so I'm making the rear heat shield um, for the uh, that goes in between the exhaust and the the foot peg and I've got this piece of sheet uh, stainless steel sheet that I've already pre-bent but it's too big so I'm going to cut it in half I made a pencil rubbing of the rear set and then I transferred on this design uh, which I'll cut out I got to cut out this little area right here on both sides so I can bend to conform to this shape and then weld it along the edge um, and then bend it and then that'll be welded on the back end of this. Here's the cut uh, finished uh, piece, the bracket that I cut out. Um, I'm going to drill a half inch hole but I want to do one on either side because I want to elongate it so it has movement back and forth. Um, and here is the uh, shield itself that I cut in half. And it's going to be mounted right here, which means that I have to cut this down because it's going to be mounted right here and this part will be sticking out a little bit. So I'm going to cut this part maybe about right here, I guess. But I want to drill this hole first um, before anything else because it's uh, before I bend this flap over. It'll be just easier just to do it that way. Here it is, the uh, finished bracket with the elongated hole. Um, I shortened it down at the bottom, so um, it'll be mounted somewhere right there, kind of like that, I guess. And then be welded. What I'll do is I'll drill a hole here and here, and then just do kind of like a plug weld. Um, I gotta smooth out all these hammer marks and stuff like that, and then polish it up, make it look nice, uh, and then it should be finished. All right, so here is the completed uh, heat shield. Put a couple of plug welds in the back um, and uh, polished it up just to kind of match the finish of the muffler. I mean, it's not a mirror finish, but it's, uh, you know, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, next, all I gotta do is uh, bolt it on, see what it looks like, um, see how it goes. Like I say, it's not going to probably block out a lot of the heat, but uh, at least my shoe is going to be coming into contact with the um, muffler itself. So, Well, there it is installed. It looks like it fit perfect. Um, and there's a little bit of room in between the, gear, the shield and the uh, exhaust pipe, so that's a good thing. Um, yeah, it works. So, um, there you go. Uh, give this video a thumbs up uh, if you like it. And uh, hopefully this will help you out if you ever need anything like this. Thanks for watching.